The Malleus Maleficarum, or The Hammer of Witches, is one of the most chilling and influential books in history, responsible for igniting the witch hunts that swept through Europe during the 15th to 17th centuries. Written in 1487 by a German Catholic clergyman named Heinrich Kramer, this text acted like gasoline on the already burning flames of fear, superstition, and religious zeal. But how did a single book lead to the persecution and death of thousands of people, mostly women, accused of witchcraft? Imagine this, it's the late 1400 and the world is gripped by paranoia. Strange events are happening, crops failing, sudden sicknesses, unexplained deaths, and people are looking for something or someone to blame. Into this atmosphere of fear steps Kramer with a book that claims to hold the answers. His message? Witches are real, and they're all around us, consorting with demons, casting spells, and working to destroy the Christian world from within. The Malleus Maleficarum was more than just a guidebook. It was a call to arms, offering step-by-step -step instructions on how to find, interrogate, and eliminate witches. The book is divided into three parts. The first part, it lays out the truth about witchcraft, where it comes from and why it's a deadly threat. Kramer claims witches make packs with the devil, use dark magic to harm people, and even fly through the night to secret gatherings. The second part explains the supposed tools of the trade. Kramer describes in vivid detail how witches cast curses, summon storms, and cause death and destruction. But the real horror is in the third part, where things get truly sinister. Here, Kramer explains how to hunt witches, using torture to force confessions and punish them with death. And here's the most shocking part. He insists that most witches are women. According to him, women are weaker, more susceptible to sin, and more likely to fall under the devil's influence. This misogynistic view fueled the targeting of women, leading to thousands of innocent people being accused, tortured, and executed. Often burned at the stake, the Malleus Maleficarum spread rapidly, becoming a guide for inquisitors and authorities across Europe. Even though the Catholic Church initially criticized it, the damage had already been done. It was embraced by those who sought to rid the world of witches, leading to the widespread witch hunts that would terrorize Europe for centuries. So. Why is this book so important? Because it shows how fear, superstition, and religious extremism can take hold of a society and lead to devastating consequences. The Malleus Maleficarum wasn't just a book. It was a weapon that turned neighbor against neighbor and justified the persecution of thousands. Today, it's a grim reminder of the dangers of hysteria and the power of words to shape history in terrifying ways.